Good morning, Belzer. I'm Demi. And I'm Sophia. We are here to bring you the latest in Belzer news. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Today is Thursday, August 25th. It is National Banana Split Day and a Silent Reading Day. Today's lunch menu is pasta bowl and garlic toast, four by six variety pizza, BLT chef salad with egg, ham, turkey, and cheese bagel, green beans, and potato wedges. In the news today, Tiger Woods has confirmed that he will miss the Masters Tournament this year. He had a back operation last October and he says he doesn't know when he will return to professional golf. Stephen Hill, an actor on Law & Order and Mission Impossible, has passed away at the age of 94. The producer of Law & Order said Stephen Hill was one of the truly great actors of his generation. Now to Claire with the sports and weather update. Good morning, Bruins. Today's weather will be a high of 90 degrees and a low of 69 degrees and partly cloudy. In sports, last night all games were canceled, but tonight cross country, 8th grade football, volleyball, soccer, girls soccer, and boys soccer play away. 7th grade football play home against Franklin Township East at 515. Let's bring home the win for all. Now back to our anchors. Thank you, Claire. Friday during lunches, 8th graders who made honor roll during the second semester of their 7th grade year will receive a certificate and candy. This year, students will be recognized for honor roll after the first nine weeks. High honor roll is all A's and no more than one B. Honor roll is a combination of A's and B's. Tickets for Lawrence Night at Lucas Oil are on sale for, at, for $10 at all, at all lunches. You must purchase a ticket to ride the fan bus. Tickets at the gate will be $13. Student Council is now taking applications, which can be found a, at a table at lunch or in the main office. Completed applications are due back to Ms. Wood. Project Lead the Way still needs your help. Please collect lids of any size from plastic bottles such as water bottles, laundry detergent, and sports drinks. Drop off all lids to Ms. Heck in room B106. There's a prize for anyone who brings in a baggie full. Many of you attended the fall fundraiser presentation on Wednesday. Proportions of it will be aired on our broadcast tomorrow for those who do not make it to the live presentation because all students are encouraged to help the school by selling something from the handout you received during college prep yesterday. Here's today's interesting fact. The ball is only in play for about 11 minutes in an average NFL game. Today's celebrity's birthday is Sean Connery, who turns 86 today. On this day in history in 1944, Paris was liberated from the Nazis by the French and American infantry. Our quote of the day is from Gabby Douglas, who once said, the hard days are the best because that's where the champions are made. Now to Mr. Harsha with the rest of your morning announcements. Have a great day, Bruins. Good morning, Bruins. Uh, I just want to take a minute before we get into our silent, sustained reading for today. Um, I want to take a minute to thank all of the students and the teachers and the counselors, administrators, security guards, IAs, everybody who participated yesterday afternoon um, in making sure that our students and our building were safe. Uh, obviously, guys, we we can control a lot of things here during the day, but um, the weather and Mother Nature is one of those things we can't control. Um, it came at a pretty bad time just before dismissal, and I want to commend particularly our students on the way that they showed patience and maturity. I was down particularly, uh, I spent most of my time down in the um, A hallway with some of our seventh graders, and I was extremely proud of the way that they behaved themselves. I know that your patience was tested. I know some of you were a little bit nervous about the weather. Um, it was getting hot. There were all sorts of different things and obstacles that were getting in your way, and I was very, very proud of the way that you were able to overcome that, remain calm, stay seated, and you did a great job um, keeping quiet so that we could communicate. Um, so I just wanted to take a real quick minute on a positive note to thank you, and again, to my teachers and uh, all the staff here, thank you so much for all that you did yesterday to make sure that our students remain safe. Have a great day.